Hi, it's Matt Luxton from FA Fitness. Today I'm going to take you through the progressions for the squat. The very first thing we need to mention is the muscles that we're going to be using in the squat. Okay, predominantly going to be the glutes, okay, which are the, your, bum, your bum, okay, your quadriceps, which are on the front of your leg here, hamstrings, okay, and also the core, okay, to hold us, hold us in place. A couple of key points for the, for, the, for the squat, which I always coach to my clients, is to make sure you keep the knees and toes in line as we, as we drop the hips towards the ground, okay, and that the knees don't go over the toes, so we're going to sit the hips back. I'm going to demonstrate that through to you in a moment. Okay, so when you're going to squat, feet just slightly wider than shoulder width, okay, knees and toes in line, okay, make sure you keep the head up, okay. I like to imagine I'm holding on to an object here, okay, if I'm doing it body weight. So you're going to imagine you're holding on to an object, okay, and you're going to squat there, okay, bending the knees, okay, taking the hips back. So from the front, hopefully the knees are staying in line with the toes, okay, and we sit the hips back, keep the chest open, and we're in there. Okay, so from the side. Okay, the hips are the first thing that goes back. The first thing that goes back is your hips. Okay, I don't want your knees to bend first because otherwise you'll end up in this position here. So sit the hips back. Okay, keep a nice straight back, looking straight forwards, ahead. And we're in there. Okay, I like to go to about 90 degrees on that, on that exercise, no, no lower really for, for health. Okay, the next thing we're going to do is just to progress on from that. So once you've done your 8 to 12 reps, you're feeling really comfortable with that exercise, nice and strong, you're going to go to what we call a double stop squat. Same foot position, okay, same posture, the only thing you're going to do is stop halfway down, stop at the bottom, stop halfway up, stop at the top. When we stop at the top, the knees are slightly bent, okay, so we don't lock the knees out, okay. Show you from the side. Stop. Stop, 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 okay? Slight bend at the knee, okay? At the top of the range of movement. Stop, 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 stop. Okay? That's great because it helps us to reinitiate that starting point of the movement, okay? Not only at the top, not only at the bottom, but in the middle as well. The next thing we're gonna do, Okay, once we've got really strong by doing the, the, the normal squats that I showed you first, then the double stop squats, okay, we're now going to do jump squats, okay. So from here, you're going to squat like we were, but you're going to get a little bit of air, okay. So you're going to squat, jump. Now obviously, the stronger you are, okay, the more reps you'll do of that without your legs burning too much, okay. Keep the core tight whilst you're doing it. And then also, as a progression from that, you can jump higher. Okay, so the, the lower, you're going to lower down, and then you'll just jump up a little bit higher. Okay, so that's how you can progress the exercise. That's the squat. 